Welcome back to another vlog. I hope you guys are doing fabulous today. Big up, big up, big up. So guys, today will be a daily vlog. Listen, I catch my husband today because he's off and I'm like, pardon me for the day. Let's hang out. Let's run errands, you know? So I mean, I forgot Target. I need to go to Ulta. I need to go to the hola, post office. Hola, 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 I need to go hola, to the hola, supermarket. Hola, 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 I need to go hola, hola, hola. Leave me out of the gym because it looks like it's a holiday thing. Mm -mm. Oh, I need to do an Amazon oh, return. Man. So, we have a few errands to run today. You get stuck with me. I'll do that, baby. You get stuck with me today. <laughs> Leave me at the gym and come pick me up. Ladies, you know, when we get to a husband, we get them, right? So, get you. All right, all right, all right. All right, so we're going to go in the gym, do a quick little workout, and then we're going to um, carry on with the day. I, do... I tell you what. Mm -hmm. I hang out with you all day today if lunch is on you. That's fine. Red lobster. Poya tropical. <laughs> <laughs> Don't try to switch up. <laughs> Listen, if you eat the same thing every single day, so why? Because me, I buy lunch, you want red lobster all of a sudden. Right, baby, I go hang out with you. I go hang with you. And the thing is, you may really deserve red lobster because your birthday is coming up of tomorrow. Of course. Hooray, yep. hooray, hooray, hip, hip, hooray, hooray, hooray. Today was his sister, my sister in law's yeah, yeah, birthday. Yeah, yes, yes, one of my beloved um, sisters. You know, yes. just one year apart. Ooh, exactly yes. one year apart. Yes, so big up sissy, big up, yeah, big up, big up. Big up, sister. big up, big up, big up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Today is her birthday yes, and then yes, tomorrow yes. is Boo's birthday. All right. Mm -hmm. So you may deserve a little something, something, something. Yeah, guys, Boo Lifestyle, guys, just up on over to the channel, guys. Listen, I, re I need to reach 20,000 by tomorrow. You understand? <laughs> yeah. I'm 17 something right now. So I need to reach 20,000. Do 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 guys. Uh, Welcome to all the new subscribers yes, over guys. here on the yes. channel because I got some new subscribers. Much so love, much love for Much that. love yes, to you. Yes. Thank you for subscribing. Sit back, get relaxed. Yes, guys. Live happy environment, you know? Yes. Comfortable environment. Nice and comfortable. Yes, Alisa came and boo lifestyle. Yes, guys. Yep. So watch some old videos, um, get familiar with us and just, just enjoy, you know? Yes, guys. Remember, leave a like on the video. If you're not already subscribed and you're watching this, Please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. So, just at the gym, first step, baby, is Ulta. I need to make a return. Okay, okay, okay. And I need sunscreen. So, that's our first step. So you what? How was your workout? It was good, but guess what? Because I never eat before I go to the gym or I do a smoothie or I do nothing. But me didn't want you. I was me very don't weak. I didn't want you because I'm telling you. You know, for fully stomach, but get something, something. Yeah. If it's even a food. But the thing is, I was trying to do a little fast, you know. I, I got you, I got 16 you. 16 eating, so you. now I'm kind of hungry, but let's go inside Ulta for But, boo, you tell him what you do. You do lift 315 pounds. Yeah, yeah guys, you know, turning 70, I just want to just wanna see where I'm at inside of the gym, and I mean, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm still there comparing to last year. I'm, nope. I'm still there. I'm still there, you know. And y y you heard that guy? Yeah, there was this guy and he was like, excuse me, do you mind, you know, how old are you? And Boo is like, you know, I'm turning 70 tomorrow. And the guy was so shocked. Like, he's like, the only other person him see. You want to tell a story? Yeah, I'm saying, yeah. Him, him said, listen, at 70, I've never seen nobody at 70 bench press 350. Yep. The only person I ever see was my trainer, and he's yeah. 62. Yeah. You know, but guys, listen to me. You know, this seed, I've sown it long years ago. So I'm just reaping the benefit of it now when people see me and giving me all the compliment. Because yeah. when I was younger doing all of this, people just see me, you know, just up and down. But now that I'm... You know, in the later stage of my life you now, yeah. doing what I'm doing you now, it is amazing to people. Mm -hmm. But as yeah. I say, guy, don't take you, you know no help for granted. You understand? Just mm -mm. so, so as much as you guys can so into no help because, listen, we're not gonna reap the benefit later on in life. Yep. Thank you. 
Inside the Target right now. I don't really want it no more. Just coming in from makeup wipes, really. Which I could have gotten at Ulta, but I have Jade gave me a Target gift card, so I wanted to use it up. Babe, come here. Want anything in here? I have a gift card. I can treat you. Okay, good. <laughs> Give me the whole store. <laughs> it's a twenty-five dollar gift card. Oh man. <laughs> you want anything though? Yes. I need a. I need a lotion and I need some some shaving gel. Okay. All right. So that's the lotion. Yeah. Guys, we're so in sync. So we we'll just come out at Target and a driver well, supposed this, this to smell, stop. This smell nice, you know? Really? Mm. <laughs> so listen, we we'll just come out at Target and uh, this driver supposed to stop because we are at the pedestrian crossing. Never stop. But it's just funny to me how oh, me and Boo in we're sync. The first word coming from my mouth, all, all fat. fat. <laughs> <laughs> the, the two of we say the same time. Um. <laughs> So I have a few more stops to make, but I'm going to get my husband some food. Thank God, thank God. <laughs> thank God. Thank God. Yeah, I'm going to get you some food. Alright, my baby. That sounds good. Alright. So we're inside Walmart right now we need to come in here to get some things and we're going to go around to the grocery section too boo where are the so look on some gloves baby well you have about 10 pair of gloves already no but it can't too much you enjoy your pre-birthday dinner today oh, thank you Lunch. baby oh you had a bomb because i'm such a good wifey okay boy so you can just imagine what fate expect with my birthday hey not much not hey, really what, what do you mean by no my you come get everything on, come today on, come on, come on, come on. listen you get to hang out with your beautiful wife today come on come on stop the loose you had no, lobster man. today come, baby baby to what more baby. can you want tomorrow is the day you say you want a fly swatter yeah me need one because as i say summer come now and you sit on outside, boy, fly them just a pitch pitch. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm mosquito, you know, because listen, you see, even the mosquito, the, when you spray the off on you, yeah, the mosquito don't respect them stuff, <laughs> them still a bite it. you up. Oh, so I go grow and I said, I'm find a, a fly swatter. What else we need? We need fruits, avocado, yes, we need orange, apple, American pear, probably some ripe banana. Mm -hmm. So let's go around and see what's what's there. I don't I don't know if I'm going to the right place. Look at this thing, you know. I'm just assuming they have it in a hard way, you know. Yeah. But let's see. Let's ask question. I mean, how you feel? How I running errands with me? You, you okay? No, no, I mean, you good? I mean, feel good. You know, I mean, hey, you know, who'd wanna? In the street with a foxy lady like you. Look, look, look. big up crew, watch it. Look how the woman sexy. You know, pro, you, listen, you know, proud I am for oh, beside a sexy woman like you. Oh, yeah? Although the old boy ain't looking by himself, but, but hey, you know, well seasoned baby, that's what you call this.
so we made it back home. How do you feel, Boo? Feel good. You made it in one piece? Yes. Right? Yes. To be honest, I was very good. I never stay long in the store. Them I look and I read and I smell. No, I was a good girl today. No, I was buying my food. Me flex with you. Him say as long as I feed him, he will flex with me. You know hear that? Yeah. So let me just show you guys a quick little haul of what I got inside. Also, I got this under eye patch from the cream shop, I think. Um, so this one says rested. I like to use under eye patches from time to time. I got my NYX bro pencil. This is the one I use and it's in the color Espresso. And then what I really went inside Ulta for was to do a return and to pick up my sunscreen. This sunscreen, the super goop unseen sunscreen. This one is in SPF 40. And that's basically all I got inside Ulta. And then inside Target No, I just picked up some makeup wipes. And you guys always, a few of you always ask me where I get my robe. When I wear that gray one, it's from Target, guys. So, yeah, I got this one, which is the black with the white. Very soft, just very, very comfortable. They even have, like, some PJs as well, like shorts and tops. Same material, very, very soft and just cool. So, and it's from the brand Above the Stars. I got mine in a medium large. Then guys, we'll go inside Walmart to get some fruits and things like that. But I went to look at the press-ons and I saw some new ones. So this one is from Salon Perfect and it's like their Milky Pearl, glazed Milky Pearl. Look how pretty this is. See that? Look how pretty this is, guys. And then I saw this one from Kiss as well. It's their bare but better um, shade. Look at this one. Very, very cute, guys. I love the shade. Cute, that pinkish, nudish shade. And then, guys, I picked up another moisturizer for my husband. Um, I've been getting him into his uh, exfoliating and moisturizing and sunscreen, right, Vu? Yeah, baby. Yeah, so this one is from Neutrogena. It's their triple age repair moisturizer and it has SPF 25. Um, it improves the look of wrinkles, uneven tone, and firmness. So this is it. Love it, love it. Yeah. And then he got like shaving gel, body wash, things like that, men's stuff. Um, so that's basically it. I went to the post office. I picked up packages. I went to do my Amazon return. I think I did everything that I set out to do today, which is good. Oh yeah. And then I came home to an Amazon package. I think these are some books that I ordered the other day. You know that I'm trying to read more. I'm very much into reading. Like, I'm such a reader right now. So, I ordered two books. I think it was a buy one, get one half off on Amazon. So, I follow a lot of people on BookTok. That's what they call people that read a lot and recommend books on Instagram or TikTok. So, if you're on TikTok, search the hashtag book talk and you get some nice recommendations so i got this one seven days in june by tia williams i wanted to start reading or incorporating more black authors into my collection so i got this one i've heard really good things about it so i'm going to read this and then i got this one local woman missing a little bit different from the romance that i'm always reading i wanted to switch things up a bit so i'm going to start reading this one and see how i like it again mixed reviews you know what not every book everybody's going to love so mixed reviews of course some people like it some people like it's meh but whatever so these are my two new books anyways guys right now we need to grab a shower freshen up and all of that and then kind of chill chill for a bit and then start some editing basically and then figure out 
what I'm going to do with the rest of the day, to be honest. Several days later. Guys, I'm in Target parking lot and yes, yes, I did come to Target earlier this week but guess what, I was with my husband and you know, if you're a female, you know when you come to these stores with your man, it's like you have your broken neck, <laughs> you have your broken neck and you don't get the chance to enjoy the full shopping experience because they're always in a so much rush. So I had to come back because there were a few things that I forgot to pick up. So I am. Um, why Target always so full? Like, I literally, not even 12 o'clock, but the parking lot is so full. Me, I park all the way down here. So, seriously? Watch here. Somebody literally, or maybe it's a. Hmm, I don't know. Somebody just get a parking close up the summer while me come all the way down here. So, but Target ever full. It's so weird when you're out shopping or whatever, and the road seems fuller. There's a lot of traffic. You're like, why so much people in the street today? It's not even twelve o'clock. It's not even one o'clock. But girl, why are you in the street? Like, why are you out here too? You know. Let me try down here. So it's okay. Sorry. Try it on you, so the parking lot full for real. Ooh, I'm gonna get lucky. I'm gonna get lucky. You see, sometimes you have to circle some look how close my day. Sometimes you have to circle the procedure, eh? literally. Right? So, you have to circle sometimes. So, I'm gonna dunk and get on iced matcha and I drink it down so fast. Today, very, very hot. Today, I give like summer, summer weather, very hot. I think this is a, one of the hottest. February is in a long time in South Florida, so So let me tell you what I need to get. I need to get my my collagen powder and my eye drops, my Lumify eye drops. And that's basically it. Guys, it's not on the list. It's not collagen powder or eye drops, but I've been looking for these canning jars, these huge mason jars. It's a 64 ounces. So when I juice, I don't have to have a multiple bottles in the fridge containing the juice. 64 ounces can hold a lot of juice. So I was checking out a Target. I checked Walmart, didn't find it, but my luck today, I found two. So I'm gonna take them. I'm gonna take the two of them, these two. So for my juices, you see, it's always good to browse the aisles. It's always good to walk around. If I did with my husband, I would not find, I wouldn't find these because I wouldn't be just walking around to see what I find, you know. So how cute are these little bowls, guys? I know Easter is coming up, so. I guess that's why they have a lot of bunny things. They have these. Oh, salt and pepper set. Little bunny with Easter coming up. And they have these little bowls. You can put candy, whatever, in them. 
and then they have the mugs as well happy easter i just love how target love the the fandangles look at this mini waffle maker it's a bunny waffle maker guys so cute uh they have that and a few others they have this one too I'm so tempted to pick up another book the thing is whenever you get into reading you can't pass books but I just <clears throat> ordered two from Amazon that I showed you so I'm not going to order anymore I don't even have a bookshelf to be honest I don't have a bookshelf so um, I'm going to pass there is a book I was looking for in here it's called the perfect marriage but I don't see it so you guys used to read James Patterson and even Daniel Steele yeah um, three days to live this sounds interesting the people closest to you may also be the deadliest in the this hard pounding collection of three brand new thrillers oh it's like a it's a series I'm not going to buy anymore until I read what I have because I don't even have nowhere to put the books to be honest and everybody know reading Colleen Hoover books and because everybody reading them I just haven't oh this is a book that I just got seven days seven days in June so I need to start reading that but yeah everybody reading Colleen Hoover books and because of that I haven't read it I haven't read it because I don't know the mixed reviews and all of that I don't know have you guys read any Colleen Hoover books? I mean, is she good? You like the books? Or it's just hype, you know? Because sometimes it's all about the hype. guys we're back last time person i nail along the way but we'll be all right um let's just walk in this little target car haul so i got the last time i went i showed you the robe right i decided to get the pajama set from the same brand above stars stars above yeah so i decided to get the pajama set it's just the top and it has the shorts the material very very soft and very nice so i can imagine just sleeping like a baby in this so i got that and i also got the lumify eye drop this is good to whiten the whites in your eye they say it works in one minute it lasts up to eight hours so i like to have this when i'm doing videos sometimes sometimes i get up really early to like install a wig or to record and then my eyes are still looking kind of bloodshot kind of red not white and vibrant and awake so i like to have this i find that sometimes to be honest it makes my eyes a little bit dry um so i don't know but i still like to use it <laughs> i still like to use it because i feel like it just makes the whites just white and vibrant so it's a small little container so I got that I got the mason jars so I think these are really good to have if you spot these and you're a juicer I would say grab them because it reduces it saves space in your fridge first of all it saves space and then you can actually know how much juice you make because it has the measurements and it's 64 ounces you can tell how many cups all of that and it's a space saver i think so sometimes when i juice i don't have adequate container and i fill up the fridge with bottles the smaller containers but with this is like bam 64 ounces so bam 64 ounces, and i would be using way less space and they weren't really expensive i think these were like oh two different receipts i have because I forgot to catch the, the eye drops, so I had to do it separately, but these were $6.99 each. 
for the jars <laughs> then i got my collagen powder so this i've been using like i put it in my tea in the morning like a scoop in my tea and then if i do a smoothie i just put a scoop or two in it as well so you know collagen they say it helps this um they say it's good for it's a they say it's a dietary supplement it says it's good for like skin hair nails and also joint support what i'm gonna say asterisk why i'm gonna say asterisk wait to joint support let me see anything is asterisk yeah for look they say these statements have not been evaluated by the food and drug administration this product is not intended to diagnose treat cure or prevent any disease you know they have to put their disclaimer because they don't want nobody to sue them so yeah i got that and then no i'm a bit thirsty because as i said today is a very hot day i got my kombucha i'm not going to drink this no and uh, i see people trying this i haven't tried it before it's the olipop and it's strawberry vanilla this one is strawberry vanilla this is a sparkling tonic i think i see that it's like soda vibe but not really soda yeah so that's all i got on my target run Ooh. i'm going to try this now cheers oh i'm going to use my duncan straw Mm. tastes good it tastes good and this is the one i got it is a strawberry vanilla flavor all right guys i am going to head on home right now i'm gonna skip breakfast this morning and i way past lunchtime so i'm going to go home and find something to eat did something to make you feel uncomfortable. I, I feel like this is semantics. Um, All right, guys. So I'm back home. Make some lunch. Um, never even recorded it because I'm so hungry. This is lunch slash breakfast slash my hungry time to eat for a morning. So I did some baked sweet potato chicken breasts and some garlic butter broccoli. Tell me why I'm so caught up in real housewives of potomac that i overcooked my broccoli so the broccoli is a little bit overcooked but that's all right we don't worry about it and my chicken breast so you know we have to talk about real housewives while i'm plate my food i love how candace is holding giselle accountable and what a wee robin Robin hold her information hostage on a reality on a reality show that's paying her mind you she's on a reality show the show is paying you to show the audience your life but no you keep your life a secret and then after the season ends you release exclusive information on patreon for five dollars a pop because apparently you have to pay for the subscription five dollars to hear her talk about one and the allegations that were happening with him and the girl in the hotel room and then everybody think is lie anyway but i digress i love how candace is keeping giselle accountable like don't play my husband's name do not blow things out of proportion for a storyline and what i think giselle did i think she deliberately wait until the season started filming to talk about chris and the how he made her feel uncomfortable because she wanted to distract from robin's storyline what was going on with her man so them just use chris as a scapegoat which i don't like so a lot of people are saying that they should fire Giselle and Robin. I don't agree. The show wouldn't be the show without them. I do think Robin and Giselle bring something to the show. You need an antagonist. You need drama and a reality show to keep it nice and to keep it going. Let me show you my food. Alright, that's it. Alright, so this is my lunch, guys. My baked potato, my broccoli and my chicken breast so yeah you need drama so i don't think that they should fire 
rubbing nor Giselle. But what I don't like is lying. I don't like the lying part of it. Don't lie on people. Husband, don't just, just, just don't. Because even me, like she just be talking. The kombucha. He had just be talking anything just to talk, see. And I don't like that. So be honest. Oh, this is the pomegranate one, by the way. Be honest. Cheers. Be honest on the show and show us your life. But I love the cast right now. I think they should keep the cast and Mia's best friend, Jacqueline. I think they should keep her. Because, but I, know, I think that's a real authentic thing because they are real friends not just friends because of the show me and Jacqueline are real friends so they should keep Jacqueline and I would love to see them try to hash out what they have going on just apologize and move on because it's years of friendship it's worth it's worth fixing you know I think because it's a real authentic friendship with Mia and Jacqueline not just for the show I think they should show them hashing things out working things out and get to the bag because if me i can bring jacqueline on the show that's a check me at the end of the day is giving jacqueline a check she's giving jacqueline an audience or helping her to get an audience and she can really get in the bag if she play the cards right so i think jacqueline should play her cards right stay on the show be a friend of the show eventually maybe she can get, she can get a peach and get to the bag at the end of the day but do not destroy your years of friendship. Do not destroy the family you have created with Mia. Same for Mia and Jacqueline. Don't destroy that just for the show. Because at the end of the day, we the viewers are watching for entertainment. Entertainment. You at the end of the day will need to deal with your reality, your friendship, and your family and keep that strong, you know? So guys, that's where I'm ending this vlog for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for hanging out with me. Remember, leave a like on the video. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.